Butterfly gon' recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime road. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'ma tell you what happened. He got smoked. That was crazy out there. Thomas Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the fire flies. When you start rapping like that? Yeah! yeah. 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 I gotta say it with me. Do you believe in an elaborate abstract scenario invented just to make this wordplay work? I do! They tried to rob him for the Samsungs. I still marvel at the tragedy. And he died, literally, as a guardian of the uh, galaxy. Oh my god! <laughs> What does it take for you to learn, Danny? What the fuck does it take for you to learn that you gotta stop doing this shit, bro? You have to stop fucking battling every goddamn week, my nigga. Stop battling every fucking week, my nigga. Stop it. Danny, Danny, Danny. I couldn't give you the pluses without the minuses, and you don't need a watch. You know what time it is. It's time to have that talk. So, you battled against Frack. And I'm not fitting to complain because a lot of this shit comes with the game. Um, salute to Frack and everything that he's got going on. Very, very lyrical MC. Takes phenomenal angles. Uh, is able to put together similes, words, bar patterns. And he's, he's a very dope rapper. Does not battle often. We will stick with that thought process. Does not battle often, right? And then I salute to every one of y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm clean. But uh, he did you dirty, bro. Like, Frack beat Danny Myers, damn near body bagged him. And it ain't even about the facts. Yes, Danny stumbled in the first round. Danny choked in the third round. Danny's in his phone in the third round looking for bars. You know, he, he started out the third talking about you would have took a race angle. And you know what I'm saying? And then you, you would have you monetized it. And then he said, if I would have did it, I would have ended up in all the blogs, the butterflies, the three letter men. So, Frack, you try to take my shortcomings and quantify it. Then you try to come up with clever ways to monetize it. But if I'd have tried it, I'd have been in all the blog sites, the butterflies and three letter men. Like, damn, he took the race angle. I appreciate the shout out, but dog, after that, you stumbled, you choked. It's a particular way of approaching an issue or problem. So, ah, oh, fuck, man. It's Damn, man, I'm sorry, y'all. You got it. You got it. You got it. Break down the angle. Problem. Run it up. It's a. So what's the angle? I found a death. And I just don't know, man. Like I know you're trying to, you know, win battle of the year and all that, but bro, it. This is not the way. Like you stumbled in your first verse, Av. You choke in your third versus frack. You choke and stumbled in your first. Bro, battling every week is not going to cut it for you. You are the reason why. Y'all want to know what happened? I'm going to tell you what happened. He got smoked. Because when you did that a couple years ago, you was battling every week. You choked against Pass. You stumbled all over the place versus Stewie New, and then you battled a random nigga in um, Miami. So, salute to Let's Talk Battle Rap. You know, they have the stats. Everything is, the stats is everywhere. So, you have battled since January 8th. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You have eleven battles, my nigga. Since January, we're only in April. Tay Rock, Skills, Sharon, Rio Nicosi, Jay Lopez, Gamble, Kaboom, Lil Slap, Roller, Av, and now Frack. My nigga, you have twelve battles. It's almost a battle every week. You're not going to win. Whatever it is that you think you're gonna win, you ain't gonna fucking win. I'm sorry. It's not happening, bro. You can't battle every week. I keep saying this shit over and over and over and over, and you are gonna keep stumbling and stumbling, and the stumbles will continue to make you humble. You're gonna learn the hard way. You one of them niggas that gotta learn the hard way. You know, gripping on the hammer, fucked around, knocked down my camera. But my nigga, you're gonna learn the hard way. I promise you, you're gonna learn the hard way. Because you ain't winning. That's the crazy thing. Now you ain't winning. You did good versus little slap, I give you that. But you're not winning. You're not winning. Frag bodied you. Frag bodied you. Ass beat you. Where we at? Where we at now? Huh? You 0-2 in your last two. 0-2. And, and do it again. Battle next week and go lose again next week. Like, you had a battle with Tay Rock that you had your best performance in in a long time on URL. You proved yourself. And then what you do? What you do after the Tay Rock battle? What you do? Most people... Most people would have chilled until they got another big name. What you do? You battle 
eight times before you battle Av, my nigga. You battle eight times before the next battle from URL, my nigga. What the fuck? Are these niggas paying you in chicken nuggets, my nigga? Like, what, what is going on here, bro? You need a financial assistant. You need a manager. You need something, my nigga, because this shit is not going to work. It's not going to work. And I got to give Frack props. Frack even tweeted after the battle, this is not the Danny that he wants, but he was happy to was his material. You know what I'm saying? Like, he, he, he got all his material off. But this is Frank deserves better than this. He deserves better than this. As an MC who's coming to battle you, bringing three rounds of fire material, well, 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 there goes your L, Danny. I will make sure I get this out to you. Go ahead and accept it. But, bro, like, why are you doing this? Why? Like, I know, I know LA gas ain't cheap. I know it's expensive to live on the West Coast and things like that. But, bro, these battles that you take, okay, you could do it. You know what I'm saying? You could continue to take these battles. I'm not gonna watch him. I did watch the frack because I didn't even watch your battle when it happened. I'm not even gonna lie. When I saw I heard that you was battling yesterday, because yesterday was my son's birthday. So when I heard it, I didn't even watch the shit. I was like, I'm not watching this. But then somebody slipped me the uh, bootleg link. If you look on YouTube right now, Frack versus Danny, there's a link out there. I watched it because I was like, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? I was cleaning up today. And I was like, well, I'll watch it. Fuck it. I got nothing. You know what I'm saying? I'm chilling this early. I watched it and bro, absolutely not. Absolutely not, bro. You're not winning anything like this, my nigga. I don't give a fuck what you think you're going to win. You're, it's not going to happen. There's nobody who's going to vote for you with doing shit like this. Battling, and then you battling a bunch of niggas you don't even have to battle, bro. Okay. Tay Rock, mandatory. Skills, don't have to battle. Sharon, one rounder, okay, cool. You don't have to take that, but you took it. Cool. Didn't beat him either. Well, debatable. Rio Nicosi, don't have to take that. Jay Lopez, don't have to take that. Gamble, don't have to take that. Kaboom, for crying out loud, don't have to take that. Lil Slap, don't have to take that. Roller, don't have to take that. You battling a bunch of niggas you do not have to battle, bro. Battle rap is a mental sport, my nigga. Your mind has to be sharp. You have to be able to pin together some of the best material in the world. And you out here doing it every week. Like I told you before, if you are winning, Nobody's gonna complain. If you battle all these niggas and you beat every single one, okay, well shit, I mean, that's just what you do. But you're not winning. That's the thing, you're not winning. You didn't beat Av. I don't know if you, if you know or not. You know what I'm saying? You my man, I ain't speak to you before, after the Av battle, but you did not beat Av. Sorry. Av had, you know why Av beat you? Because Av don't battle every fucking week. You had a battle the week before Av, the week of Av, and the week after Av. And then two weeks later, you had one guessing. Who are you being like that? Bro, you not, <laughs> you're not gonna win. Now, you could be one of the most active battle rappers, but you're not going to win. You will not win at a, high, at a high clip. And then all of these names that you're battling, they're not even good names. Quantity does not equal quality. Battling all of these niggas, did you're battling people that are less popular than bloggers, my nigga. Like, not even me. Fuck, not even mine. But you're battling people that, if I ask you, do you know this battle rapper or do you know Showtime SP? People know, more people know Showtime SP than know these niggas that you battling, my nigga. I don't even want to do my name because my name, you know, I've been around for a while. But you are battling people, and Showtime's my partner. He was just judging on King of the Dot. He's making this shit happen, you know what I'm saying? He's booming. He got 75,000 subscribers. My boy here with me. He'll be back real soon. But, 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 boy, what are you doing, bro? And if he was here, he would feel the same way that I feel. Like, you got to stop this shit. You have to stop. Like, is your money being longer worth your life being shorter? Because right now, you got a short battle rap life stand. Like, and there were, I ain't going to lie. There was some pockets of material in there that you was good. You had a couple of freestyle. You could do that, though. You're talented enough to freestyle a little bit here and there, to have you around here and there. But in the long run, it's not good enough. It is not good enough. You're not going to hold up with top-level MCs who have months to prepare for you. Frack had months to prepare for you. At least <coughs> a month to prepare for you. And this is what you bring? Because the thing is, I, I know, you don't respect the competition. That's the problem. You don't respect the competition. And I blame myself and I blame others who when you start doing good, we start giving you mad props, mad admiration and shit, start telling you like, yo, you could do this, yada, yada, yada. But bro, you're not respecting the competition. If you respected the competition, you wouldn't battle somebody every week. It's just not, have, when do you even get to prepare for these battles? Like you're preparing, you are literally preparing for a battle the week of. Like you're writing just rounds, putting them together and trying to memorize them by the day of the battle. That's not gonna work. You're not gonna beat anybody at that level, man.
You're not. You need battle rap rehab. Like, you need to go to rehab, my nigga. Like, you really... Yo, the nigga Frack was able to use all your shit against you, son. Like, <laughs> you had a partner named Tommy, and then he got died by a Tommy. You had a partner named Jim, and then he dropped the weight on his neck and died at the gym. Like, he was using all your shit against you. Parallel universe, using your kids, you know, like he was using everything, bro. Your, 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 your battle rap couple with the wife, he said the line about, uh, do you believe in a parallel universe? And then she said, I do. And then you guys got married or until death do us part, hosted by Drake. My nigga, you make so many angles for niggas to use against you that, you know, you can't be sharp as against you if everybody's against you, my nigga. Like, it's no way. Like, you can't be sharp. There's no way you could be sharp battling somebody on Saturday that had two months to prepare for you. And is your money being longer worth your life being shorter? Because at this part, I don't even really think you care. But, I, I, I mean, if I don't call it, who gonna call it, my nigga? Like, I don't, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it got to be me. I mean, it's, I appreciate the shout out in the round, you know what I'm saying? If I the flies and all of that, whoop de whoop. But, bro, that does not, that, a shout out is not an exemption from calling shit like how I see it. You became... Y'all wanna know what happened, I'ma tell Now I'ma do it again. Y'all wanna know what happened, I'ma tell you what happened. He got smoked. He got smoked by Frack. Frack smoked your ass from the venue back to where you motherfucker. You're doing it again. You don't learn. You don't fucking learn, Danny. I promise you, you don't learn. You don't learn, my nigga. That's the problem. You don't fuck. What does it take for you to learn, Danny? What the fuck does it take for you to learn that you gotta stop doing this shit, bro? You have to stop fucking battling every goddamn week, my nigga. Stop battling every fucking week, my nigga. Stop it. Stop. You gonna stop this shit. Bro, pissing me off, bro. And I support you, my nigga. We here for you and shit, but goddamn, you gotta stop this battling every goddamn week shit. What the fuck? Come on, bro. We believe in you, my nigga. You gotta believe in yourself. You gotta stop this shit. You not beating nobody. Battling every fucking week. Salute to Frack. Frack is mad nice. And he got skills. Son been nice though. Like he been, 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 been nice. And he did what he was supposed to do. We'll take the last couple seconds to talk about him. He did exactly what he was supposed to do. He broke you down. He beat you every round. He freestyled. He, he had everything that he needed. The total package to beat you. And I'm going to be honest with you. I don't think you would have beat him if he was prepared. He was overly prepared for you. What's, what's, what's prepared, prepared for daddy? Fucking 10 days? You was not going to beat him. And he did exactly what he was supposed to do. Kick your ass from here to across the street. I know it's not a lesson. You know, in every loss, it should be a lesson. But for you, I know it's not. <laughs> but <laughs> this shit crazy, bro. I'm getting the fuck out of here. I'm not even about to waste no more time on this shit today. I'm out. Damn, you gotta stop that bullshit though. I'm gone.